Absolutely. So this is a quick video on why I left Hollywood. So I went to film school at USC. I was completely set on doing the whole ladder. I worked as an assistant for a bunch of showrunners. I eventually worked on my way up to writer's assistant. Um, and then I got to write an episode of the show Condor, which is a spy show, which is my favorite genre. Um, and it's coming out in the US uh, this fall. So I did the whole ladder. I made my way to like write an episode, um, you know, worked in writer's rooms. Uh, and I had a lot of really good experiences, but overall I found the industry to be really toxic. There is nobody that I have met in Hollywood who is happy. N no, no one. <laughs> if you were happy in Hollywood, I am so grateful that you exist. Um, I just don't know you. <laughs> um, but in my, in my career in Hollywood, um, and I worked in the industry for like five years, uh, and then I also like went to film school and like know a lot of people in Hollywood and I also have a bunch of friends in Hollywood and we all kind of like looked around and like we're all you know we've, we've, we've accomplished things like I have a friend who like directed an episode of a Netflix show who's amazing I have another friend who like sold a short to HBO um, I have another friend who like worked for some of the biggest showrunners in Hollywood and some of the biggest shows like we all collectively kind of like left Hollywood when the pandemic hit and if you notice, there's been like a lot of strikes or, or there might be a strike happening with IATSE, which is the Hollywood's biggest guild. And there was a whole bunch of uh, things going on with like Pay Up Hollywood and all of these like abuse and scandals uh, since, you know, since the Weinstein thing has just been like rocking Hollywood for the past, like ever since I was, you know, starting in the industry. There's a lot of like really bad things that have happened in Hollywood <laughs> and a lot of unchecked power, a lot of... Um, really, really toxic things that happen and I kind of looked around and looked at my peer group and we were all like, I don't think this is for us anymore and it, and it was really heartbreaking because we'd all gotten into Hollywood to tell stories and to kind of like follow our hearts and do what we love, but we kind of realized that there's a better way to do it. If you haven't noticed, there's this thing called the creator economy that is starting to appear, which is us creators learning how to do other things and figure out other ways to distribute our art and make things outside of traditional things like Hollywood and other industries. Even industries like publishing, like traditional publishing are, are collapsing and like jobs are being lost and, and these things are shrinking really fast. I wrote a whole post on my blog, amysudo.com, about the, whole, the creator economy and the different like stats showing that why it's kind of going to be the next big thing but basically creators like us can be independent creators and can make money in different ways and still pursue the art that we love without participating in a toxic system but yeah that's why i chose freelancing and um that's why i'm here making content